Oh, we're good. Hey, uh, this is Jerry Topinka here, if you didn't know already. Um, Tom Doyle stopped by today from Florida, flew in with his wife, Sandy, and uh, we're having a great old time. Talking about rem reminiscing about Les Paul. Right, many times. And, yeah. Uh, well, I, let's not reminisce only about that. Let's reminisce when Les Paul and I came to see you play at the oh Pan Am Pub. In 1964, 5, 6, right somewhere around, around that's there. That's right, exactly, probably 65. Yeah, yeah. I was a kid then. I still had my thumb in my <laughs> <laughs> No, you were playing great then. And uh, Les liked you very, very much. And that was really the beginning of really the uh, association with Les Paul and you. Yeah, yeah. Of course, I was already there for a while. But the point being is, is that Les always loved you. Oh, and he had nice you come in and sat in and doing great tunes like, uh, you know, Moon Glow and so yeah. on. And we just loved that, and, we, and he would talk to me on Monday when I would drive him into the Iridium that Jerry's coming tonight, do you know that? I said, oh boy, do I know that, yes, Les. Oh and he looked forward to that because wow. he loved your conversation, he loved your wit, and you know how you played, of course, and then the kids that you brought in to idolize, that you, we idolized Les very much, yes. but then they had to meet the master yes. for the first time with and you. And sign their guitar. That's right, yes. exactly right. So this is it's really, great stuff. it was amazing times for us. Great. And uh, yeah. we can't forget this. We, we talked about this many, many times, but also, besides music. This is embarrassing. If, yeah, I know. Besides yeah. music, it, we were going in your dad's boat, right? Oh, my God. Yes. Wasn't that something yeah, else? Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. That but, was always fun. And your mom was on there with your yeah. dad, and, yeah. and you would invite me. Oh, and yeah. I say, this is some boat. He said, oh, boy. Yeah. He said, we've got to go get some gas. I said, gas? Why, this must be $800 worth of gas. Oh, know? yeah, easy. <laughs> easy. But anyway. listen, I want to talk about yeah, sure. the guitars that you made me. Oh, okay. That's important to me. Um, you know, well, that's this nice. is a Doyle guitar right here, my jazz guitar. I also have a... Uh, Let me just interrupt you. This yes. is the only one of this model is yours. Really? This, this, is, this is a Jerry Topinka model. Only he has this guitar. I made this specifically for Jerry. Because I was crazy enough to ask to have to yeah, have yes. You just make it like, yeah. Yes, right. and that's and that took a while. There's no yeah. question about that. It was that. three years. Yeah, three years. I was keeping track of it. Yeah. <laughs> three years. He wanted to but make it was sure worth, it, was worth it. it was worth the time <laughs> to wait for it. You play it well, Jerry, and I'm glad that you have oh, it. I, I love this guitar. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's, it's not just great. beautiful, but uh, you make it sound like a million dollars, too, with your playing. Uh, yeah, I read, well, I love this guitar. Yeah, it's sure. just great. And there's another Doyle guitar I have. Now, this Doyle guitar is a solid body, right. so it's a totally different animal. Right. The thing is with this guitar is that I kept bugging you from 1960, well, yeah. Les Paul. Yeah. And you didn't make me this guitar for years later. I think it was around 1978, I think. Yes. Sounds then... Good. I had you repair something on the guitar back in the 90s, yes. and you took the whole thing apart, <laughs> cut it in half. I'm like, what happened to this guitar? And then you put it here. Let's let's show yeah, the right. other guitar. And and I will get it here. It's right here on this stand. And what happened is you wrote up here, uh, Jerry, 1990. Oh. So, wow. so it's 1990, but it was really uh, another neck, great guitar. Is the neck fast enough to play on? It's after playing on this. Yes. It feels like there's nothing here. The <laughs> strings are lighter. <laughs> yeah, I have to get used to that. Different kind of a guitar. Yeah, it's yeah, a different sure. kind of guitar. Sure. And also it's only very one, fast. Only I mean. one of a kind. That's the, the only one made like wow. that too. Wow. And I made many I guitars. I must have been a real pain, huh? Well, no, you weren't. I figured he knows what he wants, so let's make him what he wants. You know, that's what it was all yeah, about. Yeah. And this is really what, you know, when I had people come into my shop in those days, I used to say, now, let me hear you play. And I would try to analyze what they really needed rather yeah. than what they told me because right. they, they really didn't know. But the difference was that you did know what you wanted, and that's what yes. I could do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember one time going in there, and because you play so well, Tom plays his finger style picking like Chet Atkins. I mean, it's really incredible. But everything's by ear. And That's you right. do know a certain amount of chords and things, right. but everything's by ear. So right. I came in your shop one day, and I'm walking upstairs, and you're with another guitar player who I can't think of who it is right now, who also play by ear. Both of you guys are going, 
Jerry, what chord is this? <laughs> I'm thinking, how do you not know what chord that is? Uh, I think it's a minor, E minor or something, yeah, well, and yeah, it, was yeah, a, yeah. E, it was E7 raised 9 or something. Right. Like. But uh, that was that kind of stuck with me. Yeah, well, it's like, true. How do these guys play that great and not know that? <laughs> we play only by ear, and we hear, the, we hear these things, and then we go to see you play, and I said, he's got a sound on that chord. i got to figure <laughs> that one out. That's true. <laughs> it's all true. Yeah. Mate, when did I used to come to see you playing Emerson at Jack Roberts? Oh, my God, you yeah. were with Chalo then, right? Uh yeah, and Freddie and my brother Fred. Right, I right. think we were that's Stony right. Moss the, or whatever. That's right, called. yeah. Right. But uh, Tom, I know you got to go, so we'll wind it up. Okay. It was great seeing you today. Great seeing you. I love you, Jerry. Really love you too, man. You know, we're great friends. He's a good guy. You know that, right? Okay. Tom is a good guy. That's Tom and I right there. Wow, isn't that something? Yep. We did a show together, and yes. then we did the That's hands right. at the end. Right. you got to send me that yeah. picture, Jerry, so yeah. I can blow it up like that. Yeah, I used to have model hands. Now I have any, <laughs> hardly any fingers at all. <laughs> Baloney. Uh, You're still playing great. I, you were just playing with uh, Glenn Alexander. I yes. saw a little thing. You're playing great. Yeah, Glenn is a great player. Yes, he is. He's Talk a to fine Martin person. Taylor. I'm going to see him in uh, oh, April. Mark, yeah. So, yeah. Remember we did that show with Martin Taylor? Oh my oh, God, yeah. what a great show that was. Great yeah. show. Yeah. But listen, we got to go. I know you got to go. Okay. Sandy's waiting. Okay. So we'll see you guys. Take care. Yeah. Okay. Take one picture of the art. I did.